A very good morning to you. You are watching Entrepreneurship Tuesday only on Y in the morning on Y254 channel. My name is Hilda Wadili and for our final interview of the day this Tuesday, please make sure you do slide into our DM and let us know what you thought about some of the interviews we just had, especially the acrobats and you, all of you who are hustling, whatever hustle that is, as we'll tell you one more time, so long as it's putting food on the table, bring it to Entrepreneurship Tuesday and let the world know. All right. So with me in studio for our final interview, I have a physical fitness trainer with me. He goes by the name of Gideon Anoka. But I want him to say good morning to you. Good morning. All right, Gideon. So we'd like to understand. You're a physical fitness trainer, yes? Yes, yes. What qualifications do, does somebody need in order to become one? Every qualification. You're supposed to be a professional before you go to this. What so do you study? Do you have to do nutrition? Do you, do you, what, 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 what happens? Uh, there's a course for fitness mm -hmm. that you're supposed to go in school. Mm -hmm. The certified uh, institution is called American Certified Council on Exercises. Oh. It's an S, mm -hmm. uh, S school. Mm -hmm. So from there, when you're certified, it has a lot of things that we cannot talk about. We have kinesiology, we have uh, anatomy, we have everything that is combined. Mm -hmm. Actually, uh, instead of calling it fitness, mm -hmm. call doctor in fitness. Doctor in fitness. Yes. <laughs> Interesting. I like that. Doctor in fitness. Yes, because we are like this with the doctors. Mm -hmm. Just that our industry, most people have, right now is when people are realizing mm -hmm. what fitness is. What fitness is. People yes. now have started to realize yeah, the be importance. Before it was just like, who any bouncer? At you yeah. <laughs> when they see somebody when you're a major yeah, guy, yeah, it yeah, must yeah. be a bouncer. Yeah, it was a very wrong thing. And uh -huh. armor, it's a crime. Something of a doing with a crime. Mm -hmm. Right now, people are understanding fitness because of the current situation you're living in and the technology as well. Okay. Everyone's supposed to work out. Mm -hmm. Yes. So this is your main hustle, yeah? This is my main hustle and my main thing, my passion actually. So for how long have you been doing this? This is my 16th year in the industry. 16th year? No wonder you look like that. Okay, yes, all yes, right. No, yes. It makes sense. Yes. <laughs> 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 all right, so let's take, let's, uh, there's some very common questions that people like to ask yeah. uh, physical fitness trainers, yeah, yeah, yeah. especially when it comes to workout and diet. Yes. So let me start with this, with the most basic one. On yes. a day-to-day -day basis, yes. does gender have any effect on the kind of workout I should do? Like, uh, does it matter what kind of exercises I do based on my gender? No, 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 no. Mm -hmm. uh, what matters is your body type. Mm -hmm. Yeah, body type. Yeah, body mm -hmm. type. We have different body type, mm -hmm. and uh, as the body type is, that is how the workout will define. So for you, mm -hmm. you might have we have ectomorph, mesomorph, and menomorph. So ectomorph, mesomorph, mesomorph, and me endomorph. Damn. So uh -huh. the three type of the bodies, mm -hmm. it has different workouts. Mm -hmm. But uh, right, right now, you'll get someone who has a uh, lesser fats. And someone who has more fats. Also, so it's the fat that determines. The content. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, you have big person and the mid intermediate and the small one, right? Mm -hmm. In a layman language. Mm -hmm. So these three type of people, the bigger person wants to become like a smaller person, mm -hmm. or the smaller person wants to become like the biggest person. Yes. Then in between these workouts that are crisscrossing here and here, mm -hmm. which is uh, an athlete and an unathlete. Mm -hmm. So it depends with uh, an individual when it matters is about the body type. It's not about the gender. Okay, yes. okay, okay. Yes. So take me through your day-to-day -day routine. When I wake up in the morning, mm -hmm. what should I do first? Should Definitely. I stretch before I work out? Someone was even asking if you should stretch even after you work out. Yeah, so yeah, I just yeah. like to understand your routine. Yeah, it's very easy. Mm -hmm. At least every day do something. Mm -hmm. And this thing you're doing, even waking up from the bed is a workout. Mm -hmm. But now when you wake up, mm -hmm. just do something small, which is now, you see when your body is sleeping, your body is at a sleep. Mm -hmm. So when you wake up, some senses in your body are already a lot. Mm -hmm. So what you really need to do to make your body uh, uh, adapt to the day, mm -hmm. try and do the stretches. Mm -hmm. the, the stretches is, are very good for you. Stretches? Yes. You can need we to see stretch. some of these stretches that yeah, I can yeah. do in a split second when I wake up and yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. in a hurry? I'll introduce my yes. one of my guy I'm using for stretches. Hi, and Dennis. It'll be better. Hi. <laughs> yeah. So right. will it be here? Is it yes, okay? Yes, yeah, let him stand here and first decide. Okay. So anytime mm -hmm. you wake up from your bed, mm -hmm. first of all, when you wake up, you don't wake up on your bed like this. You lean on to hua. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you need to lean on the side mm -hmm. and then step down mm -hmm. and then sit on your bed. So seated, just mm -hmm. sit, try to sit. He don't worry, he does everything. Eh? Okay. So when seated on your bed, that is sitting, right? Mm -hmm. When you come up straight, mm -hmm. that's a stretch already. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now hold there for a few seconds and raise your arms up straight, both mm -hmm. arms up straight. Mm -hmm. yeah, yes, yeah, yes. Now <laughs> this is it. Mm -hmm. You go all the way up and you go on your toes, on your toes there. Mm -hmm. you relax there. 
for a few seconds, mm -hmm. few seconds, you mm -hmm. drop down mm -hmm. and release your arms down straight. Mm -hmm. That's the first stretch. Now, mm -hmm. since you've stretched only your uh, your major stretch, mm -hmm. now you need to take it on the side. Take so it on the, to side, the side. Yeah, on the side completely. Wait, wait one second before yes. you even go there. You've mentioned yes. that I that waking up like this is not the correct yeah, yeah, yeah. method to wake yeah, up. Yeah. Why? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> because uh, mm. you know your body is designed in another way. Your mm -hmm. body is not designed the way you want it to be designed. Okay. So when you wake up like this, mm. it is like you know. That's have you ever heard someone saying when I wake up I cannot even go a step, I feel like dizzy. Ah yes, something yes, like that. Yes, yes. Yeah, that is a problem. So when you're sleeping, <coughs> turn on the side. Okay. Then when you're turning after turning on your side, step down. Now wake up easily. Not like this, you're <laughs> not working out. <laughs> so <laughs> Thank you, you so much for the clarification. I really needed to know why. Yeah. All right, all right. Now let's carry on. So okay. now from this one now you take it side. Mm -hmm. Just simple stretch. This one, anyone can do it. Mm -hmm. You just take it side completely and then you relax to your max, mm -hmm. not to his max. Mm -hmm. okay? To your max. Yes. Mm -hmm. Then change the side. Mm -hmm. You can change side, do the other side. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that is it. And by stretching, you will feel your obliques mm -hmm. stretching. Mm -hmm. You'll feel your chest is relieved mm -hmm. and you'll feel at the same time your leg. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now you will go back easily there mm -hmm. and now you can do a a, a, a simple stretch. If you can't lift your leg mm -hmm. on your bed, mm -hmm. you can put your leg there mm -hmm. and stretch. Or for him, mm -hmm. you can hold your leg behind mm -hmm. and you see straight, mm -hmm. your knee is supposed to point down straight, mm -hmm. your chest to be out and all face chest front. Chest out, knee, knee straight. straight down and face front for mm -hmm. the good posture. Mm -hmm. Without a good posture, you're doing nothing. Mm -hmm. yeah. Posture. Mm -hmm. Yes, you have to work out in a good posture posture mm -hmm. so, so it's now not from enough there to just work out no 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 <laughs> just working out uh -huh. so from there you mm -hmm. drop it down and you change your leg to the other one mm -hmm. and always when you're doing this one mm -hmm. you take like three to five seconds you hold for stretch okay three to five seconds mm -hmm. three yes to five seconds yes one, yeah two, that's okay three, four, four and five, five seconds Great. one two three, three four, four and five, five. Great. Yes, right. okay. yes. So this is what they you do. That's a good stretch. Anyway. Yeah, easy stretch that mm -hmm. you can anyone can do it. Okay. Okay. Yes. So if I if I have time, for example, mm -hmm. yes, I've stretched and I'm in the gym. Yes. And I don't <coughs> even really know what I what I, what I'm looking for. I just want to feel healthier. You know, mm -hmm. I may not really mm -hmm. be fat or try yeah, to lose yeah. weight or anything. I yeah. just want to be healthier. Yeah. What what cardio can I do? Can you take us through the routine? Like if I had the time, if I had 30 minutes yes. to work out, what yes. should I do for the first 10 minutes, first 5 minutes, uh, second 10 minutes? Because I hear there's a breakdown. Yes, there's a breakdown. Yes. Can and you take uh, us through that breakdown? Yeah. And a variety of workouts mm -hmm. does not matter. Mm -hmm. What matters is you yes. and what you want. Yes. You can have one workout mm -hmm. but change the intensity. Intensity. Yes. Mm -hmm. For example, I can start with uh, a simple knee up. Mm -hmm. <coughs> knee up. Mm -hmm. A simple, simple knee up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This knee up I'm mm -hmm. doing mm -hmm. to you, it might sound is just something useless. Yeah. But remember, <laughs> I'm combining <laughs> so many muscles mm -hmm. to do what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. Now, from here, mm -hmm. if I'm a beginner, I'll mm -hmm. do this one. Mm -hmm. Now, assume I'm advanced now mm -hmm. on that level. Yes. Of course, I started warming up. Now I'm running. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now the intensity of this workout will change mm -hmm. when I'll, in, I'll I'll make it more and more and higher. You know. Oh, I'll push so it I'm a supposed bit higher. to be to yeah. picking up you the see, tempo. Like right now, yeah. Mm -hmm. You see the tempo is up. Yes. Compared to the way we started. All right. That's a workout. Yes. So it doesn't matter the variety of workouts you have, mm -hmm. and it's a wrong thing that people say we mm -hmm. have to must go to the gym. Yes, yes, it's yes. a very wrong thing, and yeah. uh, that's a myth. And if you yes. get anyone telling you it's a r it's a must go to the gym, mm -hmm. that person is not. Uh, it's not a telling you the trainer. truth. He's, <laughs> a, he's a not a fitness trainer. He's promoting the gym. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you can work out home. Mm -hmm. And actually, me, I'm an agent of training people living at home. Mm -hmm. So you actually in go Westlands. Uh -huh. I have an office. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. So we discourage people to be unfit mm -hmm. because they have this notion of gyms or gyms, you know. Yes. But us as professionals, mm -hmm. we are there to even help you train home. You don't need equipment. Mm -hmm. You need your only own body mm -hmm. to train. Mm -hmm. Yes. So let's talk about bodybuilders <coughs> just before because um um wait wait no actually no I think I'll finish with that. Okay. Um, there's a particular workout that I'm seeing. Uh, someone asked me about, which was uh, there are some exercises that you can do. This one is for the ladies yes. that could cause you to <coughs> grow, <laughs> yeah. to grow some assets. Mm, yeah, it's a good question. Don't feel shy about <laughs> it. Just ask. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. There is a workout, of course, combined with the diet. Combined with the diet. So yes. how important is the diet influence? How, how, how big, how much of a big deal? Is it enough for me to just constantly 
work out but eat whatever you want ama what is it yeah, mm -hmm. on a beginning level mm -hmm. when you get someone telling you uh, maintain your diet and go to the gym mm -hmm. it's kind of restriction mm -hmm. so to me as a trainer mm -hmm. what i really need to work on your body mm -hmm. is you to look good and to be healthy yes okay mm -hmm. so despite all those hangovers you're coming with mm -hmm. and i can manage your body mm -hmm. and i can manage you be fit mm -hmm. then i don't need to put restrictions mm -hmm. but if you want to attain a goal mm -hmm. i need you to separate the two if, if you, you want, want to attain, attain a goal, a goal mm -hmm. then this goal is about losing or building healthy mm -hmm. then the uh, the diet comes mm -hmm. in that plays 100 percent gym plays 100 percent leave this myth of 70 30. so the they both matter yes they matter mm -hmm. because you see without if you do a diet you mm -hmm. look good yes the mm -hmm. way you want but you're not fit that's true okay yes. you you're very weak mm -hmm. you look like i don't know what yes. but you see when you're training mm -hmm. and you having a diet mm -hmm. you're combining the two things in one mm -hmm. that is the best thing you can come up with the results mm -hmm. you see mm -hmm. so it really they are both having a very good uh, uh results when mm -hmm. it comes to combining mm -hmm. you cannot do one and leave one okay yes interesting what about uh is there specific exercises or workouts that i'm that i should do at a particular time of the day because uh, i can see that one is morning yes. workout what about lunch time if i just want to stretch or 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 okay. evening is yeah. there a particular no, workouts no, no, no. for times what we've done uh -huh. what we've done is not a morning workout it's a stretch it is it is something you can start with mm -hmm. anytime you want mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. this is maybe when you was waking up right mm -hmm. but right now remember when you're in the office as well you yes. stand up from your it right mm -hmm. so you have that the pendiculation stretch mm -hmm. easy you can pull your legs the up the pendiculation stretch yes oh, how does that one look like the same thing we've been doing right oh, now yeah. uh -huh. so when you stretch it's a normal stretch even you at some point you don't work out but you stretch it yes so yes. i'm giving you the general thing that someone can be can benefit mm -hmm, from mm -hmm. despite where you are okay and now when it comes to working out mm -hmm. does that doesn't mean now <coughs> you've worked out mm -hmm. you need a professional mm -hmm. to guide you through mm -hmm. Yes. How important is it for <coughs> me to have a professional to guide me through? You see, uh, this is the wrong thing people do. Mm -hmm. uh, I know even you and the friends, you yes. have the Mr. Google, right? Yes, yeah, we Google. So <laughs> you go to Mr. Google and uh -huh. then you go to uh, YouTube. Mm -hmm. And maybe me, I've posted my workouts on YouTube. Mm -hmm. So you'll go using my workouts. Mm -hmm. want you, uh, in your mind, you mm -hmm. want to look like me. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. What I've, I've, I've actually shared my results. Mm -hmm. I didn't share my story. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you, you will start reading my results. You want to become my results, mm -hmm. but you do not know the story. Yeah. Right? Yes. So a professional mm -hmm. is designed to understand your body, mm -hmm. is designed to come up with your program mm -hmm. and understand even how you're thinking. Mm -hmm. When you become a personal trainer, mm -hmm. you need to understand a, a, a client's mind. A client's body. A client's, a client's mind. Let's yes. talk about the fitness of the mind. Yes. What would you have? I'd like to understand that. As a personal, as a physical trainer. Yes. What mind exercise do you also give? No, 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 no. Uh. You see, you cannot achieve your goal if your mind is clogged together and thinking about money and doing the gym. Ah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Your body has communication, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. In order for your muscle to respond, there is some information that is sent directly in your mind. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And your mind has to respond. Mm -hmm. But assume you're working out with me, mm -hmm. your mind is in, uh, in Canada. Mm -hmm. Are we doing something? Mm -hmm. You're not doing anything. That's true. So you mm -hmm. as uh, my client mm -hmm. and not only an instructor, mm -hmm. as my client, mm -hmm. as a coach, as a, pro as a trainer, mm -hmm. you will, a personal trainer, you will be in a position to share with me almost daily uh, daily things you do. Mm -hmm. For example, I wake up in the morning, I go in my office today, I'm very upset. Mm -hmm. There's someone who has messed me up. I'm feeling so confused. So when you come to train with me, mm -hmm. I already have your problems in my mind. Okay. I know how to tackle you from A to Z. So you, you actually have some, gym, wow. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah. If you just walk to the gym mm -hmm. and start doing some things, that is when you end up with the injuries mm -hmm. and you start blaming the trainers. Ah, okay. So I injuries also as a result yeah, of yeah, stress. Yeah, yeah, You've yeah, just yeah. gone there with yeah, stress. Yeah, you need the coordination of everything for you to attain what you want. Uh -huh. It's very simple as that. You can't come in the gym and start just doing some things and you have stress. Like you, mm -hmm. assume you're driving yes. and you're thinking of uh, something at home. Mm -hmm. Will you concentrate? Um, definitely not. You won't. Yes. Even if you multitask, you mm -hmm. won't. Mm -hmm. Because at some point, you'll be carried out away be by what you're thinking. Mm -hmm. So that is when we say in fitness, you relieve yourself. It is like going somewhere and confess your sins. Mm -hmm. Then after you confess your sins, 
Mm-hmm. I, my God, I forgive you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> interesting, interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. I would like to understand um, when, when um, like for example, those exercises that I was asking you about the rears. Yes, yes. The rears. Can you just let us know what I can do if I want? Uh, if I want, because because the, the person who has asked me is really insisting. Uh, really insisting. <laughs> huh? yeah. Don't worry, I'll give him or uh, her my number so uh-huh. that she can look for me. You yes. see, there's mm-hmm. no shortcut. Mm-hmm. <coughs> this is a normal squat we do. Normal squats. Mm. Normal squats we do. Mm-hmm. You see, first of all, what matters is posture. Posture. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. So, so just go down. Mm-hmm. That matters the posture. Mm-hmm. And a lot more workout mm-hmm. come up. Mm-hmm. A lot more workout. Mm-hmm. We have something like a donkey kickback. Donkey kickback. Yes. Okay. So just kneel down. There. Yeah, like that. Mm-hmm. And chest out. Mm-hmm. Now, when you kick, you raise your leg up straight. To that position, mm-hmm. you bring it back here. So, don't kick, kick back. Mm-hmm. You see, and you alternate from this leg, you change to another leg. For how long should I be doing this? Kick uh, back? Now it depends with uh, a client. Oh, and the how difference is okay. Yes. Okay, change your leg. Mm-hmm. You see, so now when you combine such kind of things mm-hmm. and a lot more workouts, mm-hmm. these are basics. Eh? Mm-hmm. It will help you, but don't put your mind on you want to only build <laughs> the important part. Eh? As well, put your mind on. <laughs> <laughs> the whole body, because mm-hmm. you'll never, you'll never sec- uh, restrict your body from circulating blood. That's true. In every part of it, right? Mm-hmm. So that is the same thing. You'll never concentrate on one muscle in your body. Okay. Yes. So we're supposed to be all rounded. All rounded. Anyway. You'll never come to me and tell me I only want to lose abs. If and I some. Uh, uh, <laughs> if I ad- if I adapt to that concept, uh-huh. I'm not a trainer. Uh, okay. I need to make sure I adapt on helping your full body, mm-hmm. but concentrate uh-huh. on the parts you want. Okay. There's a but focus. Yes. Mm-hmm. Mm. But I cannot be in a position to come and come and tell you, uh, mm-hmm. you will only lose abs, uh, mm-hmm. that money you're wasting. Yeah. Yes. Because you'll never restrict. Mm-hmm. The fats is not, and I'll repeat this one, you don't lose fats by sweating. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm-hmm. You don't lose fats by, by sweating. sweating. Okay. You'll never sweat fats. Mm-hmm. Yes. When you work out on an intense level, you start breathing out. That's a very common mi- myth, by the way, this conception. No, no, yes. no. It's a very wrong thing. How? <laughs> if you go, t- if I start how to elaborate on how to lose the parts and whatever, I'll mm. go back to books and it will take us time. Okay. Another day, arrange for a meeting. Yes. I'll come to explain to How to lose that. fat. I know because the ladies would really want to hear that one. When people are told, mm-hmm. just run and sweat. Yeah. You lose fat. Mm-hmm. You're wasting yourself. Hiya. Yes. In fact, the recommended minutes that you're supposed to do in the gym, the beginning minutes is only 20 minutes. 20 minutes. On top of 20 minutes, mm-hmm. you're messing up yourself. Hiya. So you need to do 20 minutes as a warm-up, mm-hmm. involve your workouts, mm-hmm. and then from there, mm-hmm. achieve what you want. But with a professional, not a quack. Okay. Let's set it clear. Mm-hmm. As a client, before you start training, mm-hmm. demand for certification. Certification. Yes. You Great. need to know that person. Yes. Are you a qualified trainer? But you know, most of the people go for the cheap, the quantity. Or they just approach someone they think looks yeah, fit or in the their gym. gym I I this guy. <laughs> wow, this guy has chest and bicep. Yeah. My friend trained me tomorrow. I'm like, 10 push ups. I'm there doing what he's doing. In fact, the hours you're supposed to spend in the gym, mm-hmm. it's only 45 minutes. 45 minutes. 45 minutes. Mm-hmm. Beyond that, Beyond it's. Beyond that, you're wasting because mm-hmm. your body has a, uh, a, a point we say mm-hmm. uh, you push your body to uh, towards plateau level. Plateau. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So when you push your body towards plateau level, now mm-hmm. it's not responding. You're tearing away the muscles. Ah. So you're extra burning. Mm-hmm. You need to train. 20 minutes, you've done your kind of workout. Mm-hmm. 25 minutes, you've done you've done your warm-up. 20, 25 minutes, you've done your workout. Mm-hmm. That is the same thing you're supposed to do. And repeat, changing the variations, changing the body workout, changing mm-hmm. the kind of muscle you're working out. Mm-hmm. But not to go in the gym from 7 mm-hmm. to 9 mm-hmm. and you start telling people, ah, I train for two hours. If you tell me like that, I'll have to call you in my class and train you. <laughs> So that you can understand what you're an do. amateur, huh? Yes. All right, all right. So where can they where can they find you on social oh, media and you. your uh, offices? My yes. social media. First of all, I start with my office. Mm-hmm. I'm best at uh, the end of Rapture Road. Mm-hmm. Uh, there's a building called Andrew's Apartment. Mm-hmm. In Andrew's Apartment, there's my office there. Mm-hmm. Yes. And then from there, on social media, on Facebook, my name is Coaches Gideon Onoka. Mm-hmm. On Twitter, my name is uh, Coaches Gideon Onoka, but Gideon, o- Gideon underscore Onoka. Mm-hmm. On Instagram, Coaches Gideon Onoka. Mm-hmm. And I have a blog. That mm-hmm. blog, if you go through, you'll learn so many things. Mm-hmm. It's gideononoka.blogspot.com. Mm-hmm. My number, if you mm-hmm. want to reach me through WhatsApp, mm-hmm. 0726 mm-hmm. 018 mm-hmm. 258. 
And please, when you look for me, mm -hmm. I'm not an instructor. I'm mm. a coach. You're a coach. Yes. All right, Coach Gideon, we yes. get it right. Yes. <laughs> okay, are you affordable? <laughs> Let's talk about your pricing. How do you price? I'm very, very, very affordable depending mm -hmm. on the level. Like you, you know you are a... You can't look beautiful like this without money. Oh, so you do some analysis no, on your no, clients no. so that you can know. I <laughs> no, see. No, no. Now, what uh -huh. happens is uh -huh. when we come to prices, uh -huh. it depends with an individual uh -huh. in terms of the health issues. Eh? Uh -huh. You can come to me, maybe you have uh, uh, high blood pressure, you have uh, diabetes, you have whatever, the kind of workout, the complications and whatever. Oh. We sit down and go to the doctor. We see to what level, what will it involve. A price is not just mentioned that you... Oh, so it depends also on the goals. No, no, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay. So if you go to someone and tells you, mm -hmm. across a train, everyone with 1,000 or 5,000 or mm -hmm. 10,000, mm -hmm. please run away and call me, I'll help you. All right. Yeah, okay, call Gideon. Call coaches yes. Gideon. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Dennis and Gideon, for coming yes. through to the studio today yes, and yes. letting us know that you can also earn a living and letting us know also how we can get healthy as much as we are, as it's his hustle. And this is yes. what he's been doing for the past 16 years. What are you doing at home? What have you started that is yours? What is your idea? What is your business idea? Let us know. Slide into our DM. You have been watching Entrepreneurship Tuesday with myself, Hilda Wadidi, and Barry Moses. Please don't go anywhere. You're watching by four channel we do this every day from 7 a.m to 10 a.m so make sure you do catch up with us otherwise have a good day keep warm and carry an umbrella if you're leaving the house all right bye bye